In the Caribbean, there are five programs offering citizenship by investment. Each of them is different. For example, only Antigua requires that you visit the island and stay for five days over the course of the first five years. This is also the most cost-effective option for a family of four. I'm on my way to meet the head of the CBI unit of Antigua and Barbuda, and I'll share with you some very interesting facts about this program and the island itself. Well, what I can tell you is that um, we've had about 2,500 applications submitted to the program. We have about a 5% rejection rate, so 95% of the applications that are submitted are approved. And so far we have about 5,000 new Antiguan and Barbudan citizens to the program. Well, in terms of the program, um, we have the most countries that you can have visa-free access to because a lot of people who apply to these programs um, they're actually looking for mobility being able to access um, different countries without the hassle of applying for a visa for every country because most persons who apply to these programs are high net worth individuals who are who have business um, interests in different countries and so they need the mobility to advance their their business prospects and um, you know visas can the requirement for visas can cause a hindrance so there is that and um, in terms of the value that you get for your investment Antigua is I would say number one um, right now for a family of four you make an investment of a hundred thousand US dollars and uh, you, you your entire family can obtain citizenship a lot of them actually come to Antigua because um, their family or friends have been successful. And again, because their family or friends would have had to visit the country, they laud about how beautiful the country is and then they encourage their family and friends to apply as well. Um, Sailing Week Regatta, where we have participants from hundreds, uh, over 100 countries coming in to, to, to race and to participate in the race. We have a number of regattas, not just the annual sailing week, but that is the biggest, that, that is held usually in April. As I said to you before, Antigua is a mature tourist destination, so you find that a lot of um, yacht owners, they would come and just berth their, their vessels here. And because of the amenities, Antigua provides actually services and products that you are accustomed to from your country of origin so we have a wide variety of choices in food so you go to the supermarket and you can find food from your native country um, in the supermarkets you have quite a bit of access to, to Antigua we have many direct flights from the various countries so we have the UK US Canada we have direct flights from those UK, daily Germany. yes uh, and um, Canada mm -hmm. we have direct flights daily um, last year we opened the fourth landed campus mm -hmm. of the University of the West Indies and that too is a new option um, for citizenship. You can pl apply mm -hmm. under that option, you make a donation to the University of the West mm -hmm. Indies and one of your family members uh, that is at the university age can have tuition free for a year. Mm -hmm. So Antigua is the place to be. Okay, <laughs> I agree with you. What, what we've learned is that in this industry, you thrive best if you have something that's stable. So there have been quite a number of changes in the past five years in terms of how the program looks. Uh, we're at a point where we like where the program is. We think that we have set ourselves up um, competitively. And for the next little while, there shouldn't be any significant changes to the program. In terms of, I guess because people are looking for a more reasonable option, most persons gravitate towards the National Development Fund, which is the one-time donation. Um, so when we look at our stats over the years, I would say about 85% of the donation. applications come through the National Development Fund and the other 15 is split between real estate and business investment. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, we Shimmer. have uh, 38 approved. 38 approved projects. Yes, yes. Okay. And we have them nicely outlined on our website. Okay. <laughs> They're a beautiful one. I can, I can uh, approve it. <laughs>